Okay, I'm here with Devin Keith, who just won the New Orleans Metro Championship. Uh, tell us about how that race unfolded. Uh, well, honestly, the team was pretty much preparing for this. This was definitely the hardest uh, race that we'll probably race in this state. Uh, I came in virtually knowing that I think I was going to do well and then I was going to get first and help the team out uh, with our points, you know. So, um, yeah, I mean, we did what we had to do. We won. And, uh, it's good. What's the team mindset been ever since uh, that race at St. Thomas where St. Paul's up upset you guys? Well, uh, definitely wasn't pretty at practice, I can tell you that much. We've been doing some really fast uh, uh, workouts lately. Maybe not as much volume as we usually do. Okay. They've definitely been killing us lately. So. Can you give us any details? What kind of workouts you've been doing? Uh, this one workout that we did really killed me with a 2K sandwich. Get 2,000, 200, 200, and 2,000 all out. Wow. So that was, that's the toughest thing you've done? Uh, maybe not workout wise, but uh, I mean, it was definitely tough. In fact, we did that like Wednesday. Okay. So, how. Uh, Final results haven't been announced yet, but there's some unanimous chattering that you guys probably came out on top today. Yeah. I don't know. What's the what's the atmosphere like right now? Uh, I'm pretty confident. We counted the points. We always end up doing that, so we know before anyone else. But uh, yeah, pretty pretty positive that we uh, did win. Don't and rest my morals on that. But right. I think we and uh, what what was your final time today? 15:03. Wasn't too good. But okay. Was that, how does that compare to what you've raced on here before? I've never raced this course before. Oh, so what'd you, what'd you think? Uh, it's alright. I feel like the people might have been intoxicated when they made this course. It is... Why do you say it that? Is a really, it's a really bad course, I'm not going to lie. Uh, one part seems like a snake that's just weaving in and out. And it really takes a lot right, out hey, of you. It is not a fun race. Long Honestly, this is a pretty bad course. Uh, at, what, at what point uh, after that snake did you make your move and start to pick it up? Uh, right after. Right, right after? Oh, okay. Yeah, uh, I was so happy to get out of that. Um, I was... Uh, Kind of just went all out after that. Is that about two and a half miles in, or do you know what point? I think it was about 600 meters left. Oh, okay. Great. So heading into the 3A state championship, um, what what's going to be the biggest challenger there? What team? Definitely probably our middle guys. Uh, me pushing myself. Uh, I don't really expect anyone to be near me or around me. Yeah. So if I really do want to go for another PR this year. Uh, it's definitely going to probably be my one last chances I can actually do it so uh, it'll be difficult running by myself but I mean I've had no problem in the past running by myself so I'm just gonna stay positive and work through it. So with the quality of this field would you say that this win um, and barring how your team does would be more important and meaningful than maybe a state championship win? This is the hardest race that we had uh, St. Paul's here if we do beat St. Paul's we're officially uh, number one in the state so I mean they are not only are they, they the hardest, but they have the best run of their costs and obviously. So, I mean, definitely if we win this, we'll probably use this more as what we could, uh, kind of like what we could hang our hat upon, but not really rest our laurels on. But, I mean, if we beat them this race, I mean, we're number one. So.